All right, so this is happening and you need to know about it. When I first saw this story, I thought it was a joke, but it turns out the very same government that can't fill potholes, that can't run trains on time, that has a failing healthcare service where no one seems to be able to get a doctor's appointment with an economy on its knees, that very same government believes that it's now qualified enough to dim the sun. Now, I've always pushed aside geoengineering and chemtrails in the conspiracy loony bin. But to hear that the UK government has greenlit this and is going ahead in the next few weeks with tens of millions of taxpayer pounds going into it, I sat up and started paying attention. Turns out they wanna spray these particulates into the sky to make clouds brighter to reflect sunlight back out to space. Now, as far as I knew, living in the UK basically all my life, the entire UK is already filled with cloud almost all the year anyway. And the idea that a country this big in Northern Europe by spraying its skies with who knows what is gonna affect the global climate and save us all is sheer lunacy. And you know what's crazy about it? When you limit the sun's ability to have that light reach the ground, you're affecting plants ability to absorb carbon naturally with those crazy thing called trees and plants through photosynthesis. And so what you'll see happen through this loony government program is that the ability of trees to grow will be stunted, the ability for crop yields to grow will decrease, and what you'll find across the board is that crop yields will lead to less food, less security for its country, less food all around for other animals. And this is all, to me, just a Ponzi scheme for these people to get rich off of, where these scientists or this body or this organization is able to access tons of money from UK grant money to combat climate change. It's an absolute joke. I'd prefer that to be spent planting trees and reforesting kelp forests and sea grasses and creating marine protected areas that actually do good. Excuse me for my controversial opinions, but this is nuts. And I don't see how the UK government gets to do this without the consent of its people. We're living in the clown world. Let me know your thoughts down below. Follow my page. We'll dive into it more. I need a break.